Welcome back to another morning talks, y'all. It's gonna be a little hot up in this mug. So, um, don't wear my hair. Um, it's a little messy. But y'all, my morning talks gonna be about home wreckers, cheaters, anybody who like to destroy relationships with people, etc. For my for my home wreckers, male and female. I will never understand, never, never, never understand why y'all think it's okay to wreck any home, wreck, wreck any relationship. On top of that, I don't understand how y'all people, I don't understand how people like y'all, how y'all settle to be the side piece, how y'all settle to be less than your worth. I do not, I will never, when I say never, I will never understand that. I will never understand how you can't know your worth and that you think it's okay that another bitch or nigga is in your DMs. Meanwhile, they have a girlfriend or they got a man. I don't, will never understand that. Like that never clicked for me. So that just makes no sense to me. Like you're excited because you know he has a girl or you know she has a man. And you're still fucking with her. You're still fucking around with her. Like, that's stupid to me. Like, I I just will never understand that. Cheaters. It's, it's same with the side piece shit. How can you be okay with knowing that you're not the main person? And you know that they're cheating. What are they, like, think about this. What are they going to do to you that they're not doing to that person? Like, just think about that. I just be, like, I really been on this shit lately. Like, I've just been thinking I had to say something because I'm not finna just not say nothing. Like, I can't believe that in this generation and, and even long before us, people have been okay with being a side piece. People have been okay with being cheated on sometimes. People have been okay with wrecking homes. How couldn't you do that? Like, do you not know karma is surreal? It will fuck your life up. You will fall in love with that girl or that boy. And then next thing you know, the same shit you was doing to other people, they're going to do that shit to you. I never will understand. I just I just won't understand. And like I said, maybe I'm not meant for this generation. And I don't give a fuck. But to wreck, some, to wreck somebody's relationship, to be just gross and like, no... No, I, I could never, no, ever. How about I could, couldn't could ever? Like, that's not okay. I, I don't, and no, I, it's not about you doing it and then you kind of, no, it's not. It's like, if you really don't want to be with that person or you just feel like you want to cheat, just break up with them. Tell them the truth. Like, what's, what's up with the truth these days? And it's like, no lie, I see a lot of girls being okay with being a side piece. I, I ain't gonna say it's not dudes doing that shit, but I see a lot of girls being okay with, with, with just knowing that she fucking with somebody, but you still gonna try to take them anyway, because you, you call it, I take your man type shit. You're not taking shit. You're not taking anything. Not really. You getting leftovers, sis. What the fuck? Like, you're getting leftovers. At the end of the day, when he's done fucking you, he's gonna go back to his girl the one that supports him mentally and feeds him and all that because you can't do that for him all he's doing is fucking you and telling you what you want to hear like ladies let's get it together know your fucking word that is fucking sad like i just i just don't get how it's okay to to want somebody else's man that's what like when, where we do that at like you're okay with that shit? That's gross. But the minute that shit happened to you, you and your feelings, you crying, etc. Same for the niggas. Y'all might not cry, but y'all be in y'all feelings. That's crazy to me. That, that's what this shit was about. For home wreckers, cheaters, liars, anybody that just want to fuck shit up for no reason. People that want to be mad at, and just go fuck up people's lives and do devious shit. What for what? Like... This society, I could never understand. I never will understand because I'm my own human being. But the, some of y'all, y'all need a life shape. Like, y'all really need to look at yourself. Y'all think that shit is cute. 
that y'all out here wrecking people's relationships and homes and shit like that. And the people that's allowing that shit to happen, allowing the cheating, uh, doing the cheating per se with them, that's that's on you too. Like it's not just the people that's going in and wrecking homes. The cheater himself or herself, y'all sitting out here wrecking homes. You got a whole good wife, you got a whole good man, female, whatever. And you're over here cheating on them with somebody who don't even know their own work. And you don't know yours either. Like, that's stupid. I would never understand. Y'all need to get it together, baby. I, I, I don't think that shit cute at all. And for the people out there, telling people these little, I, I, you know, just everything like, ooh, I'm going to wife you up, I'm going to cuff you, etc. But you out here lying and shit and you playing a person and they putting all their trust and in, in shit into you, you fucked up too. You real fucked up because you're giving people false hope. I don't understand that either. A person that know they don't know what they want, go sit up here and continue to tell a person that, oh yeah, I'm going to wife you up, I'm going to cuff you up. Why would you continue to do that knowing you don't know what you want? sad world we live in that's why i don't i don't mess with nobody for real i stick to myself so right. these girls will not won't be able to say when i do get my husband these girls won't be able to say oh i got your man or this and that no you don't because my man loves me and he only wants me y'all gotta choose wisely because these people they, they you got to know off of actions they want to fuck with you because other than that you will not know you won't know. You cannot be living this life. Oh, yeah, they fuck with me. They fuck with me. They gonna, you know, take care of me. No, they're not. People will lie to you dead in your face. And then you won't find out. And when you do, play, act, act stupid, play clueless. For the home records, like I said, for the home records and the people out here fucking people's lives up, y'all need, y'all, I don't know what y'all got going on. I don't know, but y'all, that karma gonna kick y'all ass. I swear, it's gonna kick you in your ass. You gonna be fucking crying because no, it's not okay. Nothing that's not okay ever get, nobody ever get away with that shit. But that's all. That was my moment of talk. So I'm a little hype about it because I've been wanting to talk about that for a long time, for a long time. And this gonna be featured on my YouTube as well. Cause no. It might be featured on my YouTube. I don't know. But y'all got to get it together, baby. I don't understand why y'all think that shit is okay to fuck up somebody's life. Like, what do you get from that? I would never understand, sweetheart. But anyways, um... I don't know. Like, that's all I got to say about that. It's a little long, but y'all ain't going to get these mother, these home records of cheaters' lies. Tuh. Tuh. I know. I see I see all of them, and it's it's crazy. I see a lot of shit. Y'all don't know I see. I peep a lot of shit y'all know. Y'all don't even know I peep. But that's on y'all. Hey. What else? But that's it, y'all. Nothing special going on here. I'm gonna go in here and do my hair. <laughs> so, yeah. Bye.